court, ICC, to prosecute APC campaign spokesperson, Mr. Bayo Onanoga, for ethnically motivated attacks. The Nigerian professor of law requested the ICC to prosecute Onanuga because as a senior journalist and chief spokesperson for president-elect Bola Tinubu, it became necessary and urgent to prevent a repeat of what happened in Rwanda and Burundi in the night. Thank you so much. I'm about this regret. Bayo Onanuga should borrow sense and stop insulting P2B. One P2B to congratulate Tinubu that the Naira appreciated when the Naira is exchanging at 140, 1,400 Naira to a dollar. APC met Naira at 187 Naira to a dollar in 2015. Buhari handed over to Tinubu at 700 Naira or 750 to a dollar. Today is about 140, 1,400 Naira to a dollar. And you said P2B did not uh, comment on it to say Naira have appreciated. So unfortunate. You see, when we complain about this issue of uh, people operating as if there is no common sense, it's unfortunate. You should carry yourself with dignity. You are occupying an exalted office. We are speaking for the president. You are occupying an exalted office, chief press secretary or personal assistant or media. You are occupying an exalted office. So by your no longer carry yourself with dignity. A party that contested with Muslim Muslim ticket. That is the party that is accusing P2B of bringing religion into politics. The man who said it is the turn of the Yorubas. That is the person that is accusing P2B of uh, ethnic politics. What a tragedy. The man who has appointed all Lagos boys, all Lagos men, all into office, from one position to the other, is the one that is accusing P2B of bringing ethnicity into politics. This group of people that said Igbos will not vote and mobilized talks to keep them away from the polling booth, they are the people accusing P2B of ethnicity. What a shame. What a shame. So please, by your no longer raise your level. Come up a little bit. You are not in Lagos. You are in Abuja. Come up a little bit. The world listening to some of the things you say. And they will be laughing at Nigeria. Where is this man coming from? Who is he? What kind of a government is this? You cannot be garbaging out things that are meaningless at your level. By your no longer grow up. You have no moral authority to be insulting P2B. He's a man of sound character. He's a man of tremendous integrity, trained in learning and in character. He's not, you cannot say P2B forged this or P2B did the other one. You should bow your head in shame. You go to office with INEC uploading blank paper as a resource sheet, pictures as a resource sheet, a glitches, the process compromised, pulling bull resort not uploaded. You upload House of Prep, upload Senator, but that of the presidency, no way. You claim glitches. We understand all these things. So carry yourself with dignity. Raise your level and stop this gutter politics. Doesn't make sense. Respect the person of P2B.
He cannot get to office through this means. Nobody will leak election for his behalf, on his behalf. He does not believe in grab it, snatch it, and run with it. He does not believe in that. He believes that if you are obtaining an office where you will be addressed as His Excellency, everything about you should be excellent. You will not attend a secondary school that never existed. You will not say hide the gender. If you dis publish, disclose the gender, you will cost me the irreparable damage. Peter P will not get involved in all those things. He will not get involved in all those things. So by your no longer raise your level. Come up a little bit. Pretend to be civilized. Pretend to be educated. Pretend to be enlightened. Just pretend for a time being. Just act it like a drama, like home video. It may not be real, we will know. But just pretend to be enlightened. Because of the office you occupy. For the image of the presidency and the Nigerian people. Pretend to be enlightened. And stop insulting P2B. This is the truth. And nothing but the truth. Let all well-meaning Nigerians share this video and be part of this process of speaking truth to power.